So this is what's happened. So a couple of weeks ago, they, there was a hotel quarant that was all the international people would come in and that's where they'll be quarantined for two weeks. However, one of the security guards couldn't keep it in his pants. Um, and oh, yeah. um, got infected. And so what happened is he infected the rest of the staff and there was some holiday event that happened, some religious one. And so the staff who knew were infected went to those family gatherings. That spread like wildfire. And then it was, I think, yeah, pretty much Victoria just got shut down super fast. But the problem is, is everyone went, oop, we better leave. And then they spread oh. really fast into New South Wales. Oh, jeez. In the past couple of days, we've had two teenagers that went to, from Queensland, went to Victoria. And they contracted it. When they were coming back, they lied on all their forms and where they've been, blah, 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 blah. And so they pretty much just started going about their lives, going back to work. And Queensland now is kind of like <laughs> exploded. That's insane. So, and apparently they were really against telling where they'd been. And so it became really suspicious. And it looks like they could be drug mule. <laughs> the plot. So, oh. Yeah. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. So luckily enough, where I am, we still don't have any cases. I think Good. last checked. But yeah. So Queensland Damn. stuff. Victoria's stuff, New South Wales is starting to get stuffed. Do you live more All because out in somebody the, uh, countryside keep it in his pants. where there's almost nothing for miles? Mm. That's got that's got to help. Ah, uh, I'm two hour drive from Sydney, so. But in saying that, I can do a three minute walk, and I've got kangaroos everywhere. Jerks. Whoa, that's awesome! Awesome work, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Have you ever gotten in a fight with one? Um, no, but riding the mountain bike to work, oh, they're massive. There's been a few that have, you know, like two meters high and they're just, you don't want them to kick you because their legs are like, you know, massive. If you've seen those videos. Can they kill people? I, I would say so. Like that kick. Can't everything would... in Australia cool, they kill people? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Pretty much. We've had um, redback spider infestation. So when I went away for Christmas and came back two weeks later, I just had redbacks everywhere. Um, and so it was kind of like when we arrived back at 11 o'clock at night, I've got the more team just spraying everything just so I can kind of get to the heat, water heater to turn it back on. The spider webs. Those spider webs are like really thick. So um, I pushed the cubby house door open and you could really feel the resistance and you could hear the snapping of the webs. And it's like, <laughs> so that wasn't fun. Are they Definitely venomous? Not... Yes. Ooh, Can yes. you just burn down the building? Uh, yeah. Just throw, throw a torch in there and be just like, all on. right, done. <laughs> Arachnophobia. That'd be me. Cut yes. your asses, yep. Come, oh. come close a few times, but <laughs> call um, the insurance I company. <laughs> I haven't come across any snakes yet, which is good. Um, what else? Kangaroos, they're a pest. Koalas, I don't see too often around here. I'm just trying to think. I'll see, I'll go for a walk tomorrow or maybe even today for lunch. I'll see if I can get a picture of some kangaroos for you guys and then. Put it up. Yeah. Are they quite um, tame? Do they go for you? Or do they leave no, you alone? No, they, they leave you alone. They normally hop away. Okay. Um, but still, it's pretty confronting when there's, you know, like 30, 40 of them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Because they're not, they're not like one or two. They're, they're like pack. <laughs> so I'll see, if I can, I'll see if I can get some photos. Nice. Wow. We just have rattlesnakes and coyotes here. And Touch the occasional the black widow. You have cows? Uh, yeah, that's it. It's so peaceful up there. <laughs>